good stuff to hear my story. The whole world hears it. And they laugh at me. Why, why are they laughing at you? I don't know, but they're on your chat and on Lifu. You think you need, you need to you know, go back to your country. So I'm who, who, said that? Who, who said that to you? No, I'm just tired. I'm okay. I'm okay even though I'm a half caste and I consider myself a black people. But that's okay. But, but you are. You are though. Okay, but you may be one out of 500 people that say that to me. You might be surprised. I'm going to the village tomorrow to look after my daughter until further notice. So, who, 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 I'm a little exhausted. Mm. If, if, you, if you could stand over there, that would be easier. Do you mind if I sit on the ground? It's up to you. What you, where you, it's up to you where you want to sit. I, I can't advise you where to sit. Okay, so that's it. I'm not asking for much. Just a little bit of help. Even if it's just to get water. But I would prefer something like a Sprite. Okay, I'll get you a Sprite. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Oh, so nice. And I have to now, I just ate four, four, four. Are you, are you, um... I was a former lawn tennis champion for Nigeria. I don't okay. know if you're familiar with me, Tanya Opala. Tanya. And Jacqueline Okwezi. During those times, I played tennis for Nigeria and Africa. Are you moving from Belarus? Yeah. Uh, you, you don't... Spread, so. No, 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 Yeah, I played long tennis when I Are you um, using any uh, recreational, you know, drugs? I'm not gonna answer. That. I have no comment. Okay, that's fine. You have the right to. I don't know why people always ask such a question. I think that's one of the sorry to say, but um, I think if somebody is very mentally sick. Yes. I don't think it's my business what the how the person is taking care of his or her life. I'm not in but I know that I would all have asked which I hope you okay and I hope you get better. Yeah, I mean, obviously, I hope that you get better, but I, I just want to see you. I don't know, I don't care. I've been labeled a prostitute. I've even been labeled the prostitute of the whole world. Also, oh, another one uh, of my uh, names is that, another one of my names here is that, Abu Monyara. I did not realize Nigeria has progressed so much that like I happen to be the stupidest person and the ugliest stupid in the whole country. So the video you just watched is the video of Tanya Opala and she and her sister um, Katia Opala both represented Nigeria in Lontenis in the 1990s but as of today she's actually seeking for help so today Anambra State government is already taking care of her Anambra State governor Charles Toledo on Sunday said that the former professional tennis player Tanya Opala is now in the custody of his government following a video of her which is now going viral where she's seeking or soliciting for help she was having chat with an uh, identified man in the streets of Oka in Anambra state you know, she was saying she confirmed that she's Tanya Opala and she represented Nigeria in the 1990s in London she was born by a Belarusian woman and a, to a Nigerian man she is said to have practiced as an immigration lawyer in the United States for some time during the conversation in the video, she seemingly, you know, as I see, she was, she tied something to her leg or something, probably, uh, maybe a wound that somehow healing gradually. She said she could not believe that Nigeria had forgotten her. She said she was labeled a lot of names, you know, yet I, all, all could understand from the video that she's actually looking for help. And thanks to True Day Namdi, who shared it, on Twitter and the video went viral. Now she's got the help she's looking for. She said, I was a former long tennis champion in Nigeria. I don't know if you are familiar with Tanya Obala and Jacqueline Okwezi during those days. She said she played uh, long tennis for not just Nigeria, also for Africa. 
I'm glad that we as a country we are recognizing our legend. You know, it breaks my heart to most of the time see you know, football legends, which no rumor, I've heard of which no rumor, who doesn't even have a house, who is not even feeding well and all that. These our legends should be properly taken care of, not the way we treat our legends in Nigeria, whether in football, handball, basketball, I mean any sport is not the way other countries of the world treat. Mostly this, this thing is predominant or rampant in Africa. Let's learn from Europeans and Americans. Once you are a legend, you are a legend. You will properly taken good care of. They will make sure that, you know, your welfare is properly taken care of. It's not just standing up all there is wasting a rumor. There are so many of our legends out there. The government should make sure that these people are here.